In this video, you will learn to reduce complexity when developing software for robotics using the modular structure adopted by the Robmosis project. This structure exchanges software components. These are collections of building blocks for the immediate composition of new robotic systems. A modular system like this requires disaggregating a robot system into different levels of abstraction. Let's examine them with an example. Ari is a robot whose mission is to serve as a butler. Its first task is to deliver coffee, so it must be capable of grasping the cup from the kitchen table. Grasping is a skill mapped to the service manipulator, a software command that serves as an access point between Ari's building blocks to exchange information. The info delivered by the service is the input of the function inverse kinematic solver. This function calculates the values that the coordinates of Ari's joints must adopt so that the end of its arm can grasp the cup. The execution container stores the calculation results that provide mapping towards the operative system and middleware. This infrastructure sends information to Ari's arm to finally grasp the cup of coffee. Ari's abstractions are divided into concerns as well. Each concern is a problem area viewed and usually solved independently from each other. Robmosis splits robotic software development into four concerns. Computation is related to active system parts that consume CPU time, like grasping a cup. Communication concerns the exchange of information between related entities. For example, the skill grasping exchanged information with the function inverse kinematic solver through the service manipulator. Coordination refers to the design and modeling of robot behaviors. This is, what are the adequate behavior steps when an event happens and which parts of the robot react? For instance, what happens if Ari grabs the cup but drops it earlier than planned? And which systems should handle that error? Configuration includes parameter settings of individual components and wiring between interacting components. For example, Ari can transport the cup from the kitchen to the table because it has components such as motion execution, path planning, and localization that are set up individually and wired to meet that purpose. Separation of concerns and levels of abstraction reduce complexity since they split up a system into parts and develop solutions for each piece. However, some robot properties are transversal to these four main concerns. For example, non-functional properties like security cannot be added to an application by introducing a module. They are rather at different levels of abstraction. Levels of abstraction and separation of concerns reduce complexity by allowing developers to focus on a single problem. But how do we ensure that we can integrate software solutions? Watch our next videos to learn how Robmosis helps you with principles to model your components. Thanks for watching.